Lawmakers in the North Dakota House and Senate advanced bills that would bar select books from certain areas of some libraries around the state. Joel Crane has the details. Some lawmakers are looking to send a message. Some will say it's censorship. Some will say it's book banning. I would submit to you this is an honest effort to protect our children. If signed into law, House Bill 1205 would ban public libraries from maintaining books that contain sexually explicit material. What possible value does this kind of, of, of information provide for our children and our society? A number of librarians testified against the bill in committee, citing censorship and unenforceability. And those opposed to it on the House floor say it's not the state's job to decide what kids can and can't read. If you are still concerned about kids accessing certain material, we already have a process in place to address that too. It's called parenting. A similar bill, Senate Bill 2360, would make it a Class B misdemeanor for institutions like libraries to display content which contains sexually explicit material that's harmful to minors. But lawmakers in favor of Senate Bill 2360 say it's not a book banning bill. This is not burning the book bill, nor is it censorship. Why? Because we are dealing with minors. The Supreme Court, U.S. v. Rydell in 1971, upheld that obscenity laws were constitutional. Some, who ultimately voted for the bill, questioned if the language was too broad. It's any written pictorial depiction showing or describing and when I look at sub six, seven, and nine, that's my anatomy book. Both House Bill 1205 and Senate Bill 2360 passed. The House and Senate now exchange the bills. At the Capitol, I'm Joel Crane reporting for your news leader.